Hey guys, I'm Liv and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to go back to my rock roots and we are going to be checking out Bring Me the Rise, a new song, Medicine, and I am super excited about this. I've said this a bajillion times, I am a former emo kid. As you can see, I have always been a fan of Bring Me the Horizon. Um, I knew Bring Me the Horizon since they came out with Count Your Blessings. That album was amazing, and I loved all of their albums up until That's the Spirit. I am a little scared to listen to this because, like, first of all, I can care less if a band changed. Like, you can go from a straight screaming band to a freaking pop band. If I can still hear something and feel something when I listen to your music, that's amazing. But the only problem I have when a band changes is that sometimes they change to try to fit an aesthetic. The, the popular aesthetic and they try to try to fit that aesthetic and it doesn't like I don't know it feels like they're forcing it but anyways enough of my talking let's just react to this I'm actually I'm actually excited because this is bring me the horizon I I love bring me the horizon <laughs> three two one because so much brighter when they go oh okay okay I like that beat Alright. It's a lot of auto tune, but to be honest, I don't care. <laughs> Ew! He's been hanging around Billie Eilish too much. This is a this is good! I love like the pop vibe, but it's still got that guitar. Hey, I was actually expecting this to be bad. This isn't bad. Oh, uh, I actually like this. Wow. Okay, I can feel something when I listen to this. This is what I'm talking about. You can change as long as I feel something. Where's that black stuff gonna come out your mouth? I already know. Ooh, uh, that grosses me out! <laughs> yeah, I love my guitar, man. I love this song. I love the vibe to this song. It's so good. Oh, I love this, bro. Yeah, okay. You guys! People were saying it, was good. it wasn't that good. Like, just because they're not screaming and it's not heavy, it doesn't mean it's bad. It's just like pop. Rock pop? Pop rock? I can still headbang to this. Yeah, I can still headbang to this. What are you guys talking about? It's like if SoundCloud and a pop punk had a baby, it would be this song. This was a good song, you guys are just jerks. You guys need to get out of your box. Bring Me the Horizon isn't gonna be a screaming band anymore. You have to accept that. that. That was a really good song. I felt something when I listened to it. Now, I know a lot of people are gonna dislike it because they're like, Bring me, they're still stuck on the old Bring Me the Horizon. And to be honest, like people grow. They're not gonna do screaming anymore. Um, I'm not saying screaming is like young for young people and stuff like that. I'm saying basically for an individual, some people don't want to scream anymore. They want to do something different with their music, and that's them growing to their own person. Now, me personally, I love screaming bands. I love all kinds of music. Um, I really love the MIDI Affliction. I love Motionless and White. Motionless and White is so freaking good. But at the same time, if a band or an artist change, I don't necessarily hate them because I like all kinds of music. So if they turn to freaking pop, if I can feel something and I can, I can still hear them when I listen to it and, and hear their heart, then I love it. Now, some people only like one genre of music, and if you only like one genre of music, that's totally fine. You're allowed to do that. But just because there's a different genre that you don't like, it doesn't necessarily mean that that genre is bad. It just means you don't feel it. But anyways, good job for me, guys, and you guys are freaking awesome. But anyways, that was my video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of me, well, you should subscribe to this channel. Stay rad, stay positive. I love your existence. Goodbye.